Welcome back, everybody, for another episode. We have a couple awesome highlights for you from this week. Make sure that you come back every Tuesday at 3 o'clock. We will have a new episode for you. All right, let's get to the part you came for. Let's see what's going on this week. All right, so we've had a pretty awesome morning so far. My Jeep, uh, Commander, like something's going crazy with the temperature gauge or something. Um, it's leaking coolant from somewhere. So we're actually now heading out back out to the range. Um, Turn left here, right? The range owner, you say straight. Say straight, okay. The range owner uh, needed some help setting up some walls for a competition this weekend and um, I offered for us to come out and help. So we're actually heading out to the range to help him set up So after we helped Scott set up the range, get a couple stages set up, we decided to stick around and shoot the steel match. It had been, I think I shot maybe one or two steel matches last summer, and you had never shot a... It was my first steel match, my first really competitive shooting experience. Yeah. Good. Yeah, it was fun. Yeah. So we thought we'd show you um, a couple stages from this. So. Alright, so our next stage was kind of another uh, USPSA style stage, I would say. Uh, you know, there's kind of a run and gun. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, Are you ready? ready? Stand by! something we regret Greg so I uh yeah I kind of broke the 180 rule as you can see here I'll show it to you again in slow motion I mean what is really the 180 rule when you're in a bay like this and you're in a you're in a competition with, with, with a bunch of hardcore competition shooters if you go to 180 this is safe Point one degrees. This is not safe. <laughs> you are going to get stopped. Yes. And in this case, I actually got DQ'd, and I wasn't allowed to shoot anymore this time. <laughs> so I made it one and a half stages before I got the boot. So what that means is I beat Greg. He did. I beat Greg on my first match ever. He did. The new guy. <sighs> he actually did. Actually, I didn't video. The double Texas star. Or double Texas stars. I smoked it. Dusty had never shot Texas stars before. Smoked it. And he killed. Let me tell you, I couldn't even put the gun back in my holster because I was so on fire. It was, it was uh, sweet. It was, it was pretty impressive. So. I'm introducing you to the brand new Neo Magmobile. I got a new 2020 Jeep Gladiator Rubicon. And 
and I could not be more excited. This is my dream truck, dream vehicle. You can keep every other supercar, every other truck, Raptor, I don't care what it is. This is the thing that I've been wanting for basically my entire life. I love Jeeps, I love Wranglers. They're just, they, they embody just ruggedness and outdoorsiness and, uh, and the fact that I also need a pickup truck. It has everything that I need in one vehicle, and Jeep finally came out with it. Well, that's a wrap. It's just some of the highlights from this week. Thank you so much for sticking around and watching this. If you like this, go ahead and hit the, the thumbs up button. Hit subscribe. We would love to see you come back every Tuesday at 3 o'clock.